27 straight wins for the Heat. This is one that was circled on the calendars, though. A road game in Chicago against the Bulls. Dwayne Wade back after missing the last two games with a knee injury. Chicago has fared pretty well against the Big Three. Six and three in the regular season against the Heat. But LeBron backing down the defense for a lay-in. Nate Robinson, though, coming up with a steal. Taj Gibson gives it right back to Nate Robb, who knocks down the triple. 40 to 27 in favor of the Bulls. In case you didn't know how many points Nate Rod got in that possession, just look at the fingers he pulled up on those three. LeBron James, 18 points in the first half as the Heat trying to get back in it. Chris Bosh spinning for the lay-in as well. But the wall dang, keeping the pressure on Miami. He had 14 in the first half. As Chicago led 55-46 at intermission, but no worries. The Heat have found themselves down in the first half in many of these games during the 27-game win streak. In the third, the Heat turning up the Heat on the defensive end. Mario Chalmers the steal, gets it to LeBron James for the slam. As he had a game-high 32 points. Then, Wayne Wade out on the break, and Jimmy Butler fouls him hard. Two former Marquette Golden Eagles getting physical with each other as the Chicago Bulls physicality on the defensive end really wearing down the heat in this one. But Chalmers hits a three and then after a Chalmers miss, Chris Bosh rebounding several times back out to Chalmers who misses again and then Shane Battier gets a try at it. That three is good and Miami is up 59 to 58. Bulls now up by one in transition. Jimmy Butler going over the top of Chris Bosh for the alley-oop. Butler getting it done. It was the Butler who did it at the United Center above the rim. 64-61 Chicago. Wade on the drive misses. The Bulls head the other way. Lawal Dang led Chicago with 28 points. Meanwhile, Wade hobbling on that injured knee. Carlos Boozer sets the screen on LeBron. LBJ running straight into it. Football style gets called for the flagrant foul. So the Heat trying to muscle up with the Bulls and the Bulls giving it right back to him. Heinrich finding Taj Gibson for the jumper. That one's good, 94-85 in favor of the Bulls. And then Robinson missing the three, but Carlos Boozer, one of his 17 rebounds, two of his 21 points, and the Bulls have the formula for success against the Heat, going inside and using the size advantage. Bulls ball, 35 seconds left. Robinson on the drive, the floater is good, and LeBron hung on the rim before the ball even went in. 54 points in the paint for the Bulls in this one as LeBron seemingly couldn't get going. And yes, the streak is over. 27 games. It falls six games shy of the 71-72 Lakers for the longest streak in NBA history as the Heat lose for the first time since February 1st.